Hey everyone, Matt Botus here, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about mounting your muffler to your engine. There's several methods that people have used in the past, uh, everything between RTV, JB Weld, paper gaskets, copper gaskets, aluminum gaskets. Uh, one of my favorite ways is the paper gasket. And you can see this one's already compressed. I've used it before. It's, it's already been mounted. But before I mount a paper gasket, what I like to do is I soak it in oil for about 15 minutes and let that oil wick up in there into the paper. What that does is it allows you to cinch it down once or twice and then you're good to go. You'll never have to cinch it down again. Uh, RTV. So the RTV can be a little bit messy. Um, uh, this is my last ditch effort if I don't have a paper gasket. What you want to do is just apply a thin layer all the way around. Okay, that side, that side. Okay, once I got enough on there with my tool, I can go ahead and take my finger and kind of smear it around. You want a really, really thin layer of RTV. You don't need much. And coat all four sides. If you get any inside of the port, you can take a Q-tip and kind of wipe the inside of the port out. Uh, and like I said, what you don't want is you don't want that coming back into the engine, getting into your glow plug and following your glow plug. Okay, after that, you can take, and I use a ball end driver, and put your screws in there. And I also like to take a little bit of RTV and place it on the threads. You don't need much there as well. And that'll keep those threads from backing out. Uh, you don't want to use Loctite uh, or anything like that. The Loctite is just going to melt under those temperatures and it's just not going to work. Um, you can also use a little bit of J um, RTV on the, uh, the exhaust port plug. This is normally used for exhaust pressure. Uh, if you're not using backplate pressure, uh, there's either a nipple there or there is a four millimeter plug. Um, so we're using backplate pressure so we basically just plug that up and again put a little bit of RTV on those threads to help seal it up and help it from uh, keep it from backing out. So, so after that you know tighten your muffler down on your engine and you should be good to go. And last but not least we have our JB Weld. JB Weld is very similar to your approach on the RTV. I've personally never used this. I do know a lot of guys who have used it with great success. Um, but you know, like I said, same approach as RTV, very thin layer. You don't want it gushing out the sides. You don't want it gushing to the inside. Uh, all that stuff is eventually gonna release and either go through the pipe or it's gonna come back into the engine. So keep it clean, keep it thin, and keep it tight. <laughs>